Uh, let's talk about invalid transaction. So a transaction is possibly invalid if the amount exceeds one thousand, or is occur within sixty minutes of another transaction with the same name in different cities. So if you're given a real string transaction where transaction I consists of comma separated value representing the name, time, amount in city transaction. So return the list of transactions that are possibly invalid, you may return the answer in any order. So this is the transaction one, this is transaction two, so I just have to parse the transaction into a transaction class. This is more readable. And this is the name, this is the time, this is the amount, this is the city. So I will have to convert all of this to transaction class and I will add into the hash map. The key is the name and the value is the transaction, the whole things. And later on, I will just have to traverse um, the transaction, uh, the hash map with the same name transaction, right? Uh, with the transaction con conflict. If they are the same name uh, in different city within the 60 minute, right? For another transaction. So uh, they just start coding. So list string. I'm going to say answer equals new or release. I'm going to return answer. Hash map. This is a string. This is uh, trans uh, list of transaction. Trans Trans So map equal to new hash map. So I need to traverse the string array and then I'll just pass the every string to the transaction class. So string C transaction. So transaction transaction trend to become new transaction T and then I will just add uh I will just add put uh trans bar name and then and then the list of transaction right but in the beginning we don't have any stuff right so this is better set put if absent and you put a trans name and new array list right then later on I need to put this current transaction into the map so map.get trans name and then this is Add, right? this is become a list so I add the transaction to the uh, current current key right so I put the trans name the name for the key and if I if if this doesn't in the map uh, I would just create it and then and then if there's if there is the key uh, in the map already then I don't need to worry about it right so put the action if there are two same name right Alice's and later on after the traversal I would just have to do it again so why do I have to do it again this is because I need to check is it invalid or not right? so string t equal to transaction and then I was going to say transaction t transaction trend become new transaction t so I'm gonna say if invalid, right? Is it invalid? And then trans with with the same same name, right? Trans name. If this is invalid, I will just answer dot add. Uh, and then what do I need to add? I need to add the T, right? This is list of string. So I need to I need to know how do I actually uh, write the is valid function, right? So it's probably will return a boolean, the public boolean, and then I need the transaction T and also the list of transaction. I'm gonna call it list. So if the amount, if the T the amount. Is greater than thousands. Return false, right? If the amount exceeds thousand dollars, return false, right? T the amount is return false. 
so I pass in a trans transaction. You can say trans over here, but I don't I don't want to type trans. I want to type T. So this is good. And also I need to traverse the list with within the same name. And um, uh, in different city and the transaction is within the 60 minutes. So for transaction hello in list. So how do we actually do this? So if different city, right? If d dot city equal to l dot city, but this should be not equal, right? They are in different city, and the and you cannot have sixteen minute transaction, which is time. Right, so map the absolute map the absolute t dot time minus l dot time is uh within which is less than equal right less than equal to sixty sixty and if this is happening return false and others will return true and this is a little bit uh hard to understand but you can get it for sure so let me check do i have any problem so there's a reason why i use math the absolute this is because um how do you actually know the time is actually smaller than the second transaction maybe you could i mean maybe they miss up already so absolutely is much bad uh better so just making sure the time is within the 60 minutes so they just run it and hopefully i don't have any typo and i do have typo this will become split three this dot oh sorry this dot city and they just run it again and it's valid map and hopefully this will be the last one and yes and yes so let's talk about time and space complexity for the time this is all of n for the full loop put is all of one get is all of one and this one is all of n for the full loop and i need to pass in i need to read uh come into its valid function and this is actually all of n for the worst case so the total will be all of n squared right so the time for the worst case is all of n squares and in space complexity this is the list of string and this is hash map and they do add, have to add every single transaction into the variable so the transaction for the space is actually all of n and if you feel any questions, such, uh, leave a comment below and then otherwise subscribe, like the video if you want. And then I will see you next time. Bye.